Some of Japan's victorious Olympic athletes have been subjected to a storm of online abuse from Chinese nationalists following the defeat of their Team China opponents in Tokyo. As of Friday afternoon in Japan, China and the hosts occupied the top two places in the medal table, with a number of events pitting Chinese athletes directly against their longtime rivals for places on the podium. And that's raised temperatures on social media on Wednesday, Japan's Daiki Hashimoto won gold in the men's all-around gymnastics final, edging out China's Xiao Ruiting by 0.4 points. At just 19 years old, Hashimoto is the youngest gymnast to ever win the event. As Japan celebrates his victory, some in China questioned the fairness of the result and accused the judges of favoritism toward the hosts by allegedly inflating Hashimoto's score on the vault. The anger, first set off on Chinese social media, soon spilled over to platforms typically censored in China. Chinese nationalist trolls circumvented the Great Firewall and descended on Hashimoto's Instagram account, inundating his feed with angry comments and tagging him in insulting posts. Many called Hashimoto Japan's national humiliation, while others accused him of stealing China's gold medal. Some even tagged him in photos of the atomic bombings of Hiroshima and Nagasaki. Some of the accounts attacking Hashimoto appeared to be created specially for this purpose, with their entire feeds filled with posts targeting the Japanese gymnast. Hashimoto later changed the privacy settings on Instagram, so he could no longer be tagged on the platform, but angry comments have kept pouring in under his posts. The attacks and harassment are emblematic of the rising tide of ultranationalism sweeping through social media in China, which has silenced many of the country's more liberal and moderate voices online. The nationalist sentiment against Japan has often flared due to deep-rooted rancor against Japan's invasion of China in World War II. Other Chinese netizens criticized the online abuse and called for an end to it, but they were also attacked. In recent years, Chinese nationalists have launched massive online trolling campaigns against those they regard as Beijing's political foes, including Taiwanese President Tsai Ing-wen and Hong Kong's pro-democracy protesters. They also lashed out at Australian Olympic swimmer Mac Horton at the 2016 Rio Games after he called China's Sun Yang a drug cheat. Following the latest controversy, the International Gymnastics Federation, FIG, issued a statement Thursday expounding on Hashimoto's score, including a detailed list of the imperfections. The FIG can assess that the 14.7 score obtained by Hashimoto on this apparatus is correct in regards to the code of points, and so is the final ranking, the statement concluded. In an Instagram post on Thursday evening, Hashimoto expressed gratitude for the support he received, while acknowledging he had received abusive comments on social media. You may think the score of the vault might be unfair, but FIG has given its verdict on the official scoring result, we have to accept the result as it is even it is very difficult to take in, he wrote. The Tokyo Olympics is not over yet, I do hope there will be less smear comments and more praises for the athletes," he added, sharing a photo of himself, Xiao and the Russian Olympic Committee's Nikita Nagorny posing together with medals. The nationalist rage against Hashimoto followed attacks on Mima Ito and Jun Mizutani, the Japanese table tennis duo who narrowly defeated the Chinese team to win the first ever gold medal in mixed doubles Monday. Tell me, don't tell me why. Oh, no, 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 you won't save my life. Save my life. Baby, keep on your, keep on your making the way.